Hello there, Fast Trackers. It's Jordan here from Fast Track IELTS, and today we're going to be looking at our tutor's three essential IELTS reading exam tips. But before we begin, let's face some facts. Nowadays, people are just not reading as much as they once did. I mean, look at you. You're watching a video teaching you how to pass your IELTS exam. You're not reading this because, honestly, reading English can be difficult and even time consuming. However, to pass your test, you're going to need to improve and practice your skills. But how, I hear you ask? Here's how. Number three read, read, and read some more. You should spend time reading every opportunity that you get, and for at least 20 minutes a day. And don't just practice with IELTS exams either. Read everything you can get your hands on, whether you're reading an online news article or the back of a shampoo bottle. It's all going to help. One reason that students struggle with this section in the exam is that their reading speed is slow because they haven't spent time practicing. The student then loses confidence because it takes them too long to find the correct answer during the exam. Whatever it is, take some time and practice and you'll see the benefits. The more you read, the more confident you'll become. Number two, skimming. The IELTS reading passage can be pretty long. Sometimes it feels like it goes on forever and finding that one tiny sentence that you need to get the full mark seems impossible. We all know what it's like, so how do we overcome this problem? Well, there is a major skill that you can use here and it's called skimming. Maybe the question you're answering is asking you, what year was William Shakespeare born? Instead of reading the entire passage over and over, you could just skim the passage, and that means to just look through it very quickly for the words that you need. So in this case, the key words would be looking for would probably be Shakespeare and Bourne. We then skim through the passage quickly to look for those words, and voila, we've got our answer. And number one, stay on topic. So a lot of students make the mistake of writing about one thing, let's say it's an essay on fossil fuels, and then by the end of the essay they're writing about something completely different, maybe their crazy auntie's cats. The reason for this is that students do not properly read the question. You should skim the passage, but don't skim the question. It sounds simple, and to be honest it is. Spend 30 seconds or a minute really understanding what the question is asking. If the question says, does William Shakespeare always write comedies? Is that different to if the question says, does William Shakespeare write comedies? Notice the word always completely changes the meaning of the sentence and the question. So there we have it, Fast Trackers three essential IELTS exam tips you need to take note of before your IELTS exam. If you found this video useful, don't forget to like and subscribe. You can also find us on Twitter at Fast Track IELTS or you can visit PassMyIELTS.com where we offer personalised tutor feedback as well as a host of free IELTS goodies. I'm Jordan from Fast Track IELTS and I'll see you soon.